Good morning everybody and welcome to Mature Movers number 28. Can you believe it? How many we've got going? So today's is going to be slightly different because I've been trying some different varieties, some hits and some other bits and pieces with my other classes. So I'm going to do a little bit of that within the Mature Movers. But let's start off straight away. All you're going to need today is a little bit of space and a chair. Everything else is being done by body weight and that's it. Are you ready? Step touch. Up, up. Lift those arms. Lift them up nice and high. Come up. Let's go. So what we're going to do is we're going to do hit is high intensity training. Now remember, you don't have to go massively high. But I've got five or six little exercises which we're going to do as much as we can with a little bit of a gap in between. We've still got the aerobics. And we've got two sets of hit exercises. One standing. And sitting. Are you ready? Let's go over, over. So push those arms. So again, it's all just trying to get you some variety so we're not copying it exactly the same. And we have done these sort of things before. Ooh, year before last, maybe. Curl it up. That's it. Keep it going. Keep it going. So obviously these are all being very popular with the geo wicks. So this is why I just thought, well, I'll just add something a little bit similar. And knees up, but sticking within my style. That's it. Now I have bought some matting actually, so I might have to start bringing it in and putting it on the floor so that they can't just hear my tap tap. And push it out. That's it. So how's everybody doing? 28 classes there. Eh? It's quite a lot, isn't it? Especially when you times it by three. And double step. That's up. Now can we tap it? Down, down, down and forward. Little heel digs. Come on, keep going. I know you quite like your dancing moves. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. March it there. Four. Can you march forward and tap? One, two, three, tap. One, two, three, tap. One, two, three, tap. Give me a V step. Out, in, out, in, out. Step touch. Nice big arms. Up and over. Chest is up, 
Now remember ladies, I know I do these in my legs, bumps and tums and my other ones, but they are important and they are working your big muscles in your legs. You need, remember what I've said, I don't want any excuses for not being able to get on and off the loo with no issues. So keep it going. That's it. Push the hips right back. You're nearly there. You've only got a couple more seconds. Only a couple. And two. And one. Okay. So pull those shoulders up. Just shake those legs out a bit. And we're going to go into alternating lunges on the spot. Just staying where you are. Are you ready? In. Oh, one second more. Four, three, two. And let's move it. Drop. And drop. Now if you're finding you felt that's easy, I don't need the gap. Great, keep going. But ideally, you're meant to put a little gap in between. Now we're only going to do six exercises on this, and I'm going to do some back onto the aerobics. Then we've got another little set of six using the chair. So again, it's swap and change them with all the other classes that are out there. That's it, keep it going. So remember. You've got your chest back and you're dropping forward and you're bending both knees as well as you can. Then we're nearly there. Four and three and two and come up. Excellent. So just shake them out again. Give me a little wiggle. Get those heels moving. And this time we're going to go into the climb the ladder. If you come to my aqua, you'll know what that is. But basically, it's a knee lift. And I want you to use your arm as well. So up, 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 up. So obviously in aerobics, we're going like this, we're going really fast. But obviously you don't need to do that. I just want the leg up, arm up, nice and high. Keep it going. If you find it, putting the hands above the head is too much. And we need to be doing some more. But anyway, if you do, just simply take them down. Keep it moving, come on. Can you believe? Nearly a year now since I saw you. Gosh, it's a long time, isn't it? Oh, dog's thinking, well, I was in here last time, I can't ask for in now. And stop there. Whew, shake it round. Now, this is the next exercise, actually. We're going to twist, but your twist can either be a nice, gentle twist, or we can speed it up. It's totally up to you. You do what you want. If you feel like giving it a bit of a jigger, then go with the twist. Let's go. So 40 seconds of keeping the hips moving. So remember, you can do the alternate, gently taking it forward, making sure the hips are always forward. Yes, hello, Bailey dog. What do you want? He's going hard to come and join in. Back to open the door, look. Definitely looks like he wants to come in. That's it, come on, nearly there. Do, 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 and ready, and four, three, two, excellent, so give it a little bend, stretch it out, haven't got side bends in, so we'll just pop an extra bit in, there we go, so don't worry, it is all planned, you know what I'm like, I don't do anything without a plan, I haven't got a plan, I just stand there going, mm, what am I meant to be doing? Right, next one, pendulum legs, lifting up, out to the side. Now I'm not after you to go right up there, I just simply want you to get your hip flexors moving. So taking the legs side to side. And remember, as I've always said, if you don't like one of these, hold on to a wall, hold on to the back of a chair, hold on to your husband, hold on to anything that isn't moving. Oh, that's probably not your husband then, is it? But anyway, <laughs> keep it going. Excellent. Come on, you've been going 10 minutes, we've got 20 minutes left. That's it. Nearly there, at the end of this first little bit. Whew. And four, three, two, yeah. Whew. You definitely feel those in those hips, can't you? All right, so the last one of this set, and we're gonna go with those half jacks. If you really want to, you can go up onto those full jacks, I'm not sure. I'm just going to hold the boobs in if I do a full jack. You ready? Arms and out, 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 out. Come on, keep going. Eight, seven, six, five. 
That's it, come on. Don't you stop on me. Keep those arms moving. Keep those legs moving. Now slow it down if you need to. You can do it at my speed, or you can do it at whatever speed you are happiest at. That's it. Come on. Get off the settee and come with me. Two more, two, and take it down. Perfect, well done. There's your first little set done. Let's go back to the step, because I don't like to waste a lot of time in class. So we're gonna put a little bit of movement together. Let's step forward and backwards. Keep it going. The heart rate hopefully has actually gone up a little bit. So no one indicated. V step. Out. And out. So remember your V step is out and in. Nice and wide and narrow. Wide and narrow. Four and three and two and one and curl. Curl those legs. Oh, there's James coming from the garage. Love the curly hair, James. I know, you've got curlier hair than me. He's looking a more like baby every day. Oh, I've got Popeye arms there. He's really, he's, he's doing well. He's really making sure he's using a load of time in the garage. Pumping up his arms, let's step up. Oh, look at those. Be picking me up soon. No, okay, maybe not. <laughs> and up we go. And back. Give me a V step and out. In, out. And can you give me a single, single, double curl? Single, single, double. Step up to the left. Up, two, three, four, and back. Two, sing, uh, V step. One, two, single, single, double curl. Single, single, give me a double step. And one, two, scoop it forward. on a chair, we're going to do them sitting down. So, down we go. So remember, same as we just did on the standing ones, you're going to do 40 seconds and 20 seconds rest. So I need you to work to the best of your ability, keeping it nice and high or nice and low, whichever you want, nice sturdy chair. Sit yourself back and we're going to start off with the inner thigh touches, which can either be right down to the inner ankles or staying up high and going with the knee. That's it. Come on, everybody. Keep it going. Sometimes 30 seconds can seem a long time. That's it. Keep moving. Up, up, up. And lift, 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 lift. All the way. Come on, 10 more seconds. So this time we're going to do a kick and a touch. So that's that double leg, a uh, single leg alternating over. Are you ready? Oh. And hang on a minute. Keep those feet moving. We'll get them turned down. Four, three, two, and up, up. Ooh, I hear my knees going. Yeah. 
after the halfway straight class. B, D, nearly there. And that's it. Whew. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and come down. Whew, I can see why some of you need a break in between now. Right, so this one we're going to do, we're just going to do the arms, now we're doing the thing with the legs, and we're going to punch. You can punch across, you can punch in front, you can punch up, you can punch to the sides. I really don't mind, don't mind if you've got flat hands or a punching hand. Ready, and four, three, two, let's go. Up, up. I'm going to go with steady, because for some reason my shoulder has never actually seemed to recover properly. We've managed to get some more equipment into the GM Perth in the garage. Phil now actually has no room at all to do any type of work on his bike or his car. So, but we've managed to get hold of some and it's quite good. But that's why James is in there busy. He's going back into full-time uh, work in a couple of weeks time because his school has decided to get back immediately after half term. So, ready, four, come on, let's go for the last few minutes, last few seconds. And four, three, two, and take it down. Excellent. So the next one, in 10 seconds, you're going to give me that full jack. So this is where your heart rate should really get up. We only did half jacks when we were standing. We're going to do full jack sitting. That's remember, double arms, double legs. You've got the option of doing one leg at a time. Are you ready? Let's go. So take it gently. And then your speed could be... Out, in, out, in. Your speed might be quicker. I really don't mind what it is. I just want you to keep moving, keep being flexible. I don't know if some of you ever watch breakfast TV, but they seem to keep getting Mr. Motivator, and I believe it's his Wi-Fi. Come on, we are better. We can do a lot more. Come on, we can do this. Four. Three, two, and take it down. Whoa. You have two more exercises in this section, and then we're going to do a little bit more aerobics, and then we're going to finish off with some seated exercises that we usually do. Now you're going to give me that elbow to the knee, you're going to twist it over a little bit of movement on the waist, and over, 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 over. Keep it going, come on. Last one. We've got one more exercise after this in this section. But this one's ideal for anybody that hasn't got any equipment, doesn't got anything they can use. Up, up, up. That's it. I'll swap the chairs around, but I still seem to have got a squeaky one. Eight, seven, we're nearly there. Five, four, three, two, and down. Okay. So the last one for sitting down until we've got onto the last section, and that is going to be that sprint. I don't mind you whether you're going to sprint coming in and out, whether you're going to do like to the box room where you go in and out, or whether you do it quite gently. Ready? Are you ready? That's it. I need those arm legs moving. I want your legs and arms staying still. If you want to, you can have the arms with it and go for a run a little bit or feet on the spot. Up and down, up and down. Or you can slow down. Give me a fast start. Come on. Come on, or you can speed it up and get everything wobbling in that area. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Woo! Well done, everybody. Up you get, let's go. Move the chair back up. Heart rate's up. Are we ready? And up. minutes more to finish off. Ooh, the director's coming out, look, he's having a look. And step up. And step back. It can be a V step. I think I've got about nine minutes. Ten. Ten minutes. Thank you, William. Single, single, double curl. Do you think William should have joined in with sort of step up? <laughs> He's got curly hair as well. I tell you, James and William have both got really curly hair. V step. What does that look for? You've got curly hair, haven't they? Single, single, double curl. 
double step. That's it. Scoop it forward. And stop. And scoop it backwards. Four, three, two, kick it up. Kick. Four more. Four, three, two. L step. March forward, three knees high. One, two, three, and back. Three knees high. And double. Superb, that's it. And march it there. Ready, now, ladies? I just want you to stretch. Give me a deadlift down before we sit down and do the last little section of the seated exercises before we get back up. Finish off with arms and legs. Two more. And come. Grab the chair. Sit yourselves down. And we did knee to elbow when um, we brought the knee in. I want you to keep your hands high. And I want you to try and go elbow down to the knee, all the way over, as far as you can. That's it. So we're not on a timer. We're just doing some. Don't squash him, William. It's all right. Four, three, and two, and one. Now what I want you to do is push it down. Come on. Down we go. All the way down to touch those feet. Outer ankles is where you're going. Outer ankles. Down we go, and again, two, and this time. Now be aware of the chair, make sure it's a nice sturdy one. If it's not, you might have to miss this exercise. I want you to go up, drop, up, drop. Lifting the knees up, pushing them down. The last thing I want you to do is um, either break your chair or fall off your chair. Now, try and hold, up, and kick. Woohoo! Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Wow! Okay, a few more minutes left. So, get rid of that chair. Let's go with those arms and legs. So, up. Now, give me the upright row. Up, down, up, down. Now, squat and, uh, squat and lift. We are only looking at doing about four more minutes. Come on, everybody, keep going. Four, three, two, one, and step it. Grab your weights if you want, or if you're just on arms, go with the arms up and down. Superb, keep it moving. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold the arms, hold the legs, up, down, up, down. You're squeezing the shoulder blades back and lift, lift, four, three, two, Bring it up and drop, 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 drop. So this is the same side. You've got your little side bends in. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Step. Are we ready? Let's go with the little step touches up. And back. Up. Two, three, four. You can sit. William. V step. Don't feel like singing. Single, single, double curl. You've got a good voice. And step up. Oh, he's giving me an evil stairs again. He did some fantastic drawing last week. I might have to V-step, put it on the wall behind me, see if anybody spots it. <laughs> single, single, double curl. Single, single. Double step, double step. Scoop it forward. One, two. Three, four, stomp, stomp, scoot back. One more little set. Step, kick. One, two, three, L step. One, two, three, four, march forward, lift those.
those knees. contact me let me know write it on the co in, on YouTube subscribe like I don't go on there very often but I will look at them and swap it back I think the dog needs a haircut as well so everybody I can't believe it's nine weeks now since I actually had a haircut get your nose out and come up Bailey I'm gonna Drop it forward. Deep breath in. Now, stay safe, everybody, and I really hope we're going to see each other again soon. Thank you very much. Bye bye.